The Walter A. Rulin Award, an honor given to an individual who demonstrates excellence in business, commitment to community, and service to humanity. The 2018 recipient demonstrates those qualities and more. Senator John Bonasek. Senator Bonasek represents the 42nd Senate District. He has always been a champion of the private sector, the small business community, and the everyday, hardworking people of our region. Thanks to the attention and dedication he has given us, he will leave office having positively impacted the Sullivan County economy for years to come. John is a one-of-a-kind guy. Unlike many politicians today, he really does make his district and the people that live there his number one priority. He made huge improvements in the quality of health care. He was a driving force in getting the laws changed in New York to legalize gaming and the subsequent location of a casino in uh, Sullivan County. He also fostered an environment and a climate that significantly enhanced job creation and economic development. He was always working for his constituents and really never let us down on any aspect of representation in Albany. He's the only politician that I know who understands in depth what's best for everyone and fights hard to accomplish things regardless of politics. Case in point, he won the 40-year fight to finally get a casino in Sullivan County. The casino brought together all the different government agencies, the volunteer organizations, uh, the service organizations, all as one. And it was because of Senator Bonasek that he was able, in his leadership, to bring this project to our county. The senator set up the framework for us to be successful, right? It was his work, and I can tell you, he understood the importance of creating jobs, he understood the revenue that was being lost, and he said, let's stop all that. Let's create the jobs where they're needed, and that, I think, was Senator Gbanasek's original vision. Having an advocate in Albany is important. Senator Bonasek has helped the organization um, with his support uh, and fighting for you know, the needs of this community. And the hospital honored him by naming the emergency room after him, and it was certainly well-deserved. There was a whole list of things that needed to be improved at the hospital, and the emergency room was the biggest. And uh, so we, we went to the senator and said, uh, look, we, we need to double the size of the emergency room, put the improvements in. Can you find us those dollars in Albany? And he listens. Senator Bonasek, he knew everybody, and he knew who you were. He took the time to listen to you. But to listen to people, this regardless of your title and position, that's an art. He became one of the, uh, the three masters of the 30-second sound burst, which, which would be Bill Larkin, Ben Gilman, and John Bonasek. In addition, he was the best-dressed legislator on the Orange County Legislature at that time, which was 1982. We've passed boatloads of legislation together. Folks are there 10 years, and they've got five pieces of legislation. But we, over the years, have passed hundreds. You can rise above what people think, and you can really accomplish goals if you put your own personal beliefs aside and think about what the masses need. Even though I am on the other side of the aisle, he's been very supportive, very helpful, and a great person to be able to talk about the issues with. One of my first recollections of working directly with Senator Bonasek was on the FAVOR program. We're trying to get veterans to come in, file their DD-214s, and as soon as he heard the word veterans, he said, you've got me. Whatever you need for our veterans, I'm on board. I will find you the money. And the rest is history. John has especially been a friend to me, a mentor. He's never let me down, he's always had good advice. John is a friend to public safety. John legitimately cares about all those people that go out in the middle of the night, put themselves in harm's way to save citizens of his district. I met Senator Bonasek when I was a state trooper, and I quickly learned from Senator Bonasek that public safety is the foundation for economic development in New York State. And his support of public safety, not just police, but fire, EMS, and all his public safety services, it's so profound that he's just a legend in, in the public safety sector. I first met John at one of the county parades in Livingston Manor, where he went to each individual fire department, shook their hands, introduced himself, the Volunteer Fire Service is a very close family, and the Senator is part of our family. He's one of us. The first time I met Senator Bonasek, it was actually not a good meeting. 
I remember the senator's quote to a mayor I was with, and the quote was, I believe your expectations are unrealistic, and you need to rethink this. Uh, that's not a typical meeting, but Senator Bonasek's not a typical guy. And there were two really good things that happened. Number one, the senator was right. But number two, the senator spoke directly to us. And 18 months later, we got the funding. Successful project, and the senator was there from beginning to end. There are no borders when it comes to job creation and when it comes to economic success. So much of the winning comes from champions. And John Bonasek has never forgotten the fact that he's here to serve the people, that he's here to create jobs and make things happen so all of his people in this region are served. The Center for Discovery really is a, a regional center. Every time we turn to Senator Bonasek, not, not only does he help, he comes to the center and he sees what we're doing and he meets the people and he, he knows what he's talking about when he goes back to Albany and he knows the center's commitment to these children and adults with these really complex conditions. And uh, you know, I really can't say enough about what a champion he's been for the center. For me personally in Roscoe, the senator has been a, a true champion and a supporter of my district. And one of the things that Senator Bonasek has been phenomenal with is coming through with additional funding in the form of bullet aid or advocating for things in the state budget that really help preserve education in our area. Senator has, has been a long-standing champion of the tourism industry in New York State, especially in the Sullivan Catskills. Our own Senator, Senator John Bonasek, is one of the most impactful senators and legislators in the United States. How fortunate are we that we've had the ability to work with him and we share in so many of the wonderful growth and development that we have here in the Sullivan Catskills, a lot of that because of him. Back in the 60s, we had over 400 hotels operating in Sullivan County. When we started Woodstock, we were down to a little over a dozen. During this period of time, John, we kept the lights on up here in Sullivan County, and you were as much a part of it as anyone to help put us back on the map, to help us redevelop the interests, to clean it up, to polish it up, market it, and introduce Bethel Woods to the world, which is now among the top 20 entertainment facilities in the world. None of this could have happened without your participation and help, John. And for that, Sandy and I and the rest of Sullivan County are very, very much in your debt for helping us, for making it happen. John has had a stellar record in protecting his taxpayers across the county and his district. He's been a fabulous proponent of economic development in so many different ways, tax cuts for small business, giving access to small business loans, making sure that we still have manufacturing where we can, balancing all that while being a great environmentalist and steward for the communities that he represents. On a personal note, uh, I've been fortunate to know him as a friend, a colleague, a mentor. He's not gonna like this part, but kind of like a father figure too. But if I knew nothing else about Senator Bonasek, his love for his beautiful wife and his children and his grandchildren transcends everything. That's the focal point of everything that he thinks about, everything he does. People in Sullivan County know that, the partnership knows that. I'm gonna miss him, you're gonna miss him, the state of New York is gonna miss him, but I'm really grateful that you've taken the time to give him the recognition that he so richly deserves. John, Senator Bonasek, we appreciate all that you've done for Sullivan County. On behalf of the Board of Directors of the Sullivan County Partnership and all of us here in Sullivan County, best of luck in all of your future endeavors, warmest wishes to you and your family, and you will always be part of our family.